next we have Liz Perry. Yay, Liz! Sorry, it's very dark in my house, so like yeah, I'm I see. my best with my lighting, but it's it is what it is when you live over here. No, you look you look good. You know we can see you. It's all good. It's like six thirty for me over here, and I haven't figured out the dynamics of the lighting in here. Whenever I'm doing the night. Oh, there you go. Something just went brighter. Sometimes when I sit a certain way, you can see me better. But yeah, there you go. Okay. Um. Yeah. So it's cool. We got two Liz's here tonight. You and me. And we kind of lost Leah tonight, Leah Weber. And we would have had two Leahs and two Liz's on the show. I thought that was kind of cool. <laughs> well, we also have Elizabeth Holthouse that does our spotlighting. Um, yeah. So we have three Liz's, technically. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> but, you know, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, three Liz's. I like that. <laughs> so, um, so, so Liz, I, I see that you, this is so impressive. I see that you've been a homeschool mom. With yeah, your three kids, three kids. Yep. whom you love so much and and you love God and you love sharing the truth of the gospel and song and conversation as it's a deep passion of yours to, to study scripture with your kids. You know, I'm going to cry <laughs> and to help them understand and learn it through song. And then, hey, it looks like you've been a good friend of um, Red since you were 15. Wow, I wish I knew Red since I was 15. That's yeah. awesome. Pretty cool. Yeah, He's such a cool yeah. guy. Yeah, when and, I was uh, younger, when I was in high school, I I wanted to I would I told him I always told him I um would love to come out and visit, you know, the cafe that he worked at at the time and There you go. Yeah, and he was like you'll get here someday. You'll get here someday and so he would just like I had a flip phone and he had a little phone and he would just like hold the phone up so I could hear the screamo bands, the Christian screamo bands that would come through uh, the place that he was volunteering for. So that's our history, a bit of our history. That's awesome. Remember the flip phones, the day of the flip phones, you know? Now we've got these massive computers in our hands. It's incredible. Yep. But um, I love how you, you, you take part in Zoom hangouts with your online family and friends. You love to sing and play, and you also do Zoom Bible studies on Monday yeah, nights. With, with Casey Bean, yep. That's awesome, and you like to take part in reading scripture and love the fellowship before and afterwards because it brings you much happiness and joy. Hallelujah. Well, sister, Sister Liz, I like to always put sister or brother before everybody I know that is in Christ. So um, I'm ready for your first song. This is exciting. What you got for us? I am going to do a, an original. I've done it on here before, on Red Stream before. Um, <clears throat> and uh, anyway. Yeah. Oh, Shelly, the coffee's awesome. It's always better when you don't make it. Christ alone, I place my trust. All of the crown slips away. You're still here holding my hand Your love will turn my darkness to day oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Like a bird flying high and free It's your banner of love over me Your love is all that I need All of my sins in the depths of the sea
Wow, Liz. Liz, that was really, really pretty. I should have warned you that was the last one. And was that, I'm sorry, did you say that was an original? That was original, yeah. That, that was really, really pretty. You know, Christ alone, I trust, and just your ending part, especially. But I just love the catchy, what, uh, 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 oh. When I wrote that song, I was like, I don't I know. like I that. Like, I can't make that a chorus to a song. I should not. I hate, I hate like, you know, filling in stuff with vocals. But I'm like, I, I don't have anything else. It is what it is. <laughs> oh, I, I love it when people put whoa, whoa, whoa's and all kinds of ooh, 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 oohs, you know? and make them like yeah just really unique to the song that was beautiful like, uh, another another red room artist is really good at that uh vanessa kirsten does that perfectly she makes me feel like oh okay it's it's okay to do that with song <laughs> that was awesome that was so wonderful hey all right so what you what you got next for us uh, that was the next beautiful. song i have is my rendition of before the throne of god above which is a song that a lot of people know because it's been around for a a very long time so. i don't know if i've ever heard of it this is awesome oh, it yeah, on. it's one of my old old timey favorites from high school nice
Oh, that was so nice. Oh my gosh, Sister Liz, let me tell you something. I've never in all my years, I'm 60 years old. <laughs> I have never heard that song before the throne of God. It's a it's a good song, yeah. Um, yeah, Christ my Savior and my God. It's just the gospel message in a song. <laughs> yeah, it's so awesome. That was beautiful. My favorite line of that song is... Um, when Satan tempts me to despair and tells me of the guilt within, upward I look and see him there, who made an end to all my sin. Amen. Hallelujah. That is just beautiful. That was just that, you know, I'm going to have to like YouTube, like different versions. Like it's going to be know, different. Then... I did it totally different than it's supposed to be done, but I've done that song since I was in high school. And I was yeah. Like, I'm going to do it a little different than you I'm develop. Doing. You develop your own style. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And that's what we're supposed to do when we're musicians. And yeah, that's what I, we write. I, I, I talked to my kids about that last night because um, I want to say his name was Robbie, the guy who was on last evening at the very end. And he did a handful of worship songs that have been around for a long while. And, you know, we know them, songs by Mac Powell and people. But he had them in his own complete way. And I said, kids, look at this. This is a perfect example of how we're meant to do music. As You know, we're not meant to just like copycat somebody else. Um, not say if you do that, that's totally wrong, but like what we're supposed to do is to take the song that the artist has put out and make it our own, you know, that's what worship is about too, is to not just be the same copycat and, um, let it be the expression of what God, the Holy Spirit puts in our, in our heart as well. Absolutely. I am with you. That's the way I've always been. You know, sometimes there are certain artists that they think they've got to play a song exactly like but no, you gotta, you gotta embrace it, right? Yeah. And just have fun with it and make it your style. Yeah. And that was beautiful. I was really beautiful. So, hey, what, what you got next for us? Uh, just an old faithful, amazing grace. Another yes. you know, just plain old gospel song. Like I like to share the gospel any chance I can get here. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. I once was lost, but now I'm found. Was blind, but now I see. It was grace that taught my heart to fear and grace my fears relieved how precious did that grace appear the hour I first believed my chains are gone
Hallelujah, sister. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Our chains are gone and we have been set free. Love it. That was beautiful. I loved your rendition of that. That was really, 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 really pretty. Hey, I'm looking at your um your Facebook says you're Lizzie Lou Who 22. <laughs> yeah, that was. It just, made uh, me think of um the Grinch and Whoville, right? I Cindy totally Lou exa- Yeah, that's what I was thinking when I did it. Now I just. I love it. Yeah. I love it. Oh, I love it, Lizzie Lou Who. That's so cute. Oh my goodness! Well, that was just beautiful. Have you got something else for us tonight? I do. Um, the music rocking and rolling. Yeah, I got one last song for us. Uh, another one that everyone should know very well. Um, Waymaker. Yes. Yes. Waymaker. You are here, moving in our midst. I worship you. I worship you. You are here. Working in this place, I worship you, I worship you, you are waymaker, miracle worker, promise keeper, light in the darkness, my God, that is who you are, waymaker, miracle worker, promise keeper, Light in the darkness, my God, that is who you are. You are here, touching every heart. I worship you, I worship you. You are here, healing every heart. I worship you. I worship you. You are way maker, miracle worker, promise keeper, light in the darkness. My God, that is who you are. Way maker, miracle worker, promise keeper, light in the darkness. My God, that is. Love the way you played it. Sounded so beautiful. 
You know, you took it way up high, you know, just way up, man. You just got it way up there, you know? I don't know how to do anything quietly or delicately, hardly. So <laughs> I, I break guitar picks. I've been playing with a broken guitar pick all night. Um, one of my worship leaders used to laugh because he's like, I have never in my life seen anyone break a guitar pick, and you break a guitar pick every oh, Sunday. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's awesome. Sorry. You know, you know, the Lord loves it, right? Especially when we break our picks. It's like, I just keep passionate about it, man. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> you are just absolutely lovely tonight. And um, I just, again, I, I just want to just tell you that it's just so impressive that you know, you homeschool your kids, you know, God bless you. And you sing and you play for them and they're just going to grow up just knowing Jesus Christ. And there's just nothing more that we can do, you know? That's what I hope. Yeah. So anything in, in closing as far as um anything you want to tell people about how they can get in touch with you or hear when you might play and sing or... Uh, basically just, um, I play on Red's Room at times, obviously, but also, um, on the Lion's Den Monday nights, the Bible study online here on Red's Room. Nice. Yeah. But other than that, I don't have anything fancy. I don't have a YouTube. I don't have anything. I don't know. I just don't. <laughs> That's okay. It's all good. And I love how, um, your Bible study is called the Lion's Den. That's cool. Yeah, that's Casey's yeah. study. I know he did. I don't think he named it that. I think someone else named it before he took it over. Yeah. I don't remember. I don't know all the details, so don't ask me. <laughs> Can you imagine, like, if you had been Daniel in the lion's den? You know, yeah, and, like, they did that. not come after you. I feel you. like Daniel was such a man of faith. Uh, you know, the Lord just imparted to him so much faith, and, and I love his stories, the stories of Daniel. Yeah. Especially the three one, the three guys that, like, didn't burn in the fire. Yeah, Remember? yeah. And and they saw that was there was someone else in there. It was Jesus in there with them. And yep. they came out like not ah oh, just I love it. So anyway, hey, listen, so thanks so much once again for being on Red's room and and just geez, you've known him since you were so young. So I have a feeling you've played and sung for him and with him probably like hundreds of times. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. This. Whenever whenever I was younger um, he used to, we used to get on like, I don't know, Yahoo chat or something like that, that had the audio and I would actually play songs. Um, you can come forward, son. They can see you anyway. He's like creeping past, like no one's going to see him. Yeah. Like, <laughs> That's my son, Joey. Yeah. Hey, Joey. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Yep. Well, That's happy fun. Easter to you all. Happy Holy Week. Yeah. You know, we've got a really special week coming up, so. Jesus, lead us to the cross. Help us remember you once again and all that you've done for us, do for us. And just, wow, you know, let's celebrate Jesus, right? Amen. For he is risen, right? He's risen indeed, right? Amen. Once again, amen. Thank you, sweetheart. Thank you for having me, guys. <laughs>